Oh. And then they'll have like healthy relationships. What's the common age? denominator? Yeah. You niggas, I hate, you. I hate it. I hate it. It's the same thing with the cheating. No, no, no. <laughs> no, 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 no. You're a villain. You're a villain. <laughs> no, big man, li- watch the show. Watch the show. It's cold. No, I'm being dead serious. It's cold. And you know what? I'd even go. To- Don't spoil it, though. Uh, Don't spoil it, bro. I'll throw my shoe at you, big man ting. I just said uh, I'm going to go watch it. <laughs> all I'll say, can all can I'll you see, say, guys? All like, I'll say is. Someone bro, why are you talking? No, 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 no. I've seen as well. I can't wait to watch it. That's going to be hilarious. It's gonna, do you know, it's, I'm actually looking forward to it, you know? You shouldn't, but. No, I shouldn't, but I'm looking forward to it because I think it's going to be good inside content. Do you know what I mean? But the way you guys are going to spit it, like. Obviously, you weren't meant to, like, get. Not meant to, but fifth was kind of where you guys were expected to finish, but mm-hmm. I'm not gonna lie to you. At the start of the season, we'll see. Right, so, right, cool. So the first one is your salary is your company's monthly subscription fee of you. Let me read that again. Monthly what? <laughs> oh, I messed up. Your salary is your company's monthly subscription fee of you. So if you just stop paying your salary one month, mm. the subscription ends. I mean, not necessarily, but I mean, for me, it will. Yeah, I'll be like, yo, you niggas didn't pay me this month, so where do we go from here? But yeah, I mean, that's true. I mean, yeah. think about it. If you, if you don't pay Netflix um, when the money's meant to come, then... The server's co- Actually, do you know what they'll do? They'll do like a reminder, like a free five-day reminder. Because yeah. I, think, I think that's what they do. Because I know Spotify do that. Yeah. And I'm not too sure if Netflix like, send like an email or anything, but... Nah, Spotify, I can't lie to you. Because I changed my card details mm. and... It's one of the reasons why I just can't be bothered. So they're saying, oh, we're supposed to take the payment today, but uh, we'll give you seven days. <laughs> and I'll be like, oh, cool, cool. I'll change it again. Um, so yeah, I think they'll do something like that. But workplace, I'll be like, yo, these niggas ain't paid me by the morning of the end of the month. I'm like... Especially if it's a big company. If it's a small company, it's still a problem, but... It's sort of... It's less... Un- it's more understandable. Yeah, but if it's a big company, you know it's no way to do it. You guys should have those, those funds and reserves or something. Yeah. Do you know what I mean? Uh, cool. The second one is... Sorry, you see how tired he is? You see, you see how tired he is? Keith, he's tired of waiting for you. <laughs> he's tired of waiting for you. Uh, cool. The second one is, I know it's random. This is very random. I, I got it from somewhere. Okay. But wild horse is allowed to shit everywhere. Because they are pets. Some of them. No, but why do police officers like get off and pick up their shit? We have to do it for dogs. That's true, you know. That's so true. They're not just here in the wild. Yeah, it's like, and it's. What the, do you know what it is, yeah? You see, police, they yeah. think they can get away with everything. <laughs> they think they can get away with everything. And I saw it's not just police who ride horses. No, a lot of them is just police. Yeah, I know it's just police, but. Mostly. Obviously, you've got the people who like living on equestrian or, you know, people who are like. Yeah. But yeah, most generally it's police in the city, so. But like, yeah, because police, they'll be parking on double yellows, stopping in no stop. Nah, let's stick with this horses thing. And the shit is a lot as well. It's a lot, you know. It's like, bro, like that much. It's like it's like the size of a parking size almost, bro. Nah, yeah, it's true. We need to start getting onto police horses. But the thing is, yeah, you, like no one wants to get close to a police horse because yeah, the niggas are big. And if those legs hit you, you're done. You're done. Yeah, you're done. Yeah, you're done. Is that you? Be complaining? Hey, yo, how do you? <laughs> what? It's too bright in it. It's crazy. It's too bright in it. Nah, it's crazy. It's crazy. Yeah, no, nah, you need to get onto police, you know. It'd be, it'd be fucking up too much. Because <laughs> if they saw your dog doing that, it'd be like, pick it up, man. Exactly. That's fine, mate. You know, you know what I mean? I've got my, got my camera here. Those dash cam... <laughs> dash cam menaces, bro. All right, cool. The third one is, mm. would you want to know your purpose? So, like, for example, if your purpose... Like, imagine your purpose, yeah, was to just, like, meet someone, give them advice... And then that's it. Yeah, that's true, you know. If that was the only reason, uh, like, that person wanted to go cure cats or something. Living like a plankton, bruv. You're just there on the <laughs> side for no reason. That's your whole lifeline. Yeah. No, I, don't, I wouldn't want it. Do you know what it is? No. Like, like you know how human beings sometimes you, you search for life through life looking for I need to go find myself. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, yeah, that yeah, type yeah, of thing. yeah, yeah, yeah. Like but then what happens if you find out it's like, some meaningless thing, like... Like, I'm supposed to... You're go to spend three pounds at KFC and then... That three pounds, that, yeah, that's it. That's it. You're yeah. just meant to spend three pounds. Like, you know what's even worse? Imagine if this thing was like, yeah, your purpose, yeah, you need to get with this person 
and allow them to cheat on you mm. so that they can become a better person. Mm. And then, and then they'll just, marry someone and then that, that child will be the Antichrist. And then, <laughs> <laughs> then it's judgment day. <laughs> what is that? that? <laughs> oh, that would be, oh my goodness. I know, yeah, that's crazy, you know. I don't know, would I want to know my purpose? Obviously, I'd love to be like, okay, this is what I'm meant to do mm. or this is, on you know, fate and everything and, you know, it's written before me. But at the same time, I don't want to know, though. I want to know, man. Look, do you know what it is? It's like, it's like, it's like when Dave said there's six paths. Do you know what I mean? There's so many paths in life you can take. It's like... No, but I don't like like being told, like, this is it. Oh, yeah. Mm-hmm. Like, imagine if someone said, yeah, like, y- you're going to uni and that's about it. Yeah, <laughs> no, no, I don't want to go. Like, exactly, bro. <laughs> <laughs> no, nah, I hate that. Don't, don't man, do that. Man, man will drop out of uni and you still seeing the timeline. <laughs> <laughs> I'm a low-key thing. The multiverse of madness. Oh my gosh, it strikes again. Yeah, do you know? What? Yeah, I don't think I'd want to know. Obviously, I'd want to like. Obviously, like ask God. Like sometimes when I'm praying, like spiritual purpose and everything like that. But at the same time, be like, just give me a hint. Like, don't yeah, explicitly me, tell me. Leave me in that way, but don't like. I don't need to know exactly. Exactly, it's a journey. It's not yeah. like you're there. That's a bit mad. But people also think is what like once you um when you die is because you really fulfilled your purpose. I think. Yeah, which is which is kind of weird because when you think about people who get in accidents and die, yeah. or it's very like everyone will be like, oh, but they like they were so ambitious yeah, or yeah. like I'll even say in primary school there was a kid who died in mm. in um, the year below me I think, but everyone sort of knew him. He was yeah. a cool kid, innit? it? Um, he died, and it was like raw. And it's crazy because I think about him time to time, innit? Mm. And I'm like. Again, it's one of those things where it's like, you know, it's God's timing or does it happens for a reason. Or yeah, but f- we, we say this is kind of to like make ourselves feel better. Yeah, because I'm thinking... Because we'll be very pissed off if it's like... Exactly. We don't say like, this is the plan type of thing. Exactly. So using that logic, he's only supposed to live until like eight years old. Yeah. So what was the purpose of that? How did he die? Huh? How did he die? Sickle cell. Oh. Yeah, so it wasn't like... Maybe it was to like make you like more mindful of who you have children with what the fuck was that well if you have children with someone who has um that thought has never crossed my mind I now it has <laughs> <laughs> now it has makes sense i thought you were gonna say something like it was gonna like make the parents appreciate life a bit more or give love I guess to so. their that could be that as well but like why does it have to be with me i mean you brought it up yeah but still and it seems like it's like you remembered it. Yeah. So. What's the next hit blunt, bro? That was, that was it. That was the last one. That's it. Yeah. That's, the, that's his purpose. <laughs> no, don't do that. Don't do oh that. Oh, my goodness. I think that was a good one, too. It was a good one, but you don't have to end it like that. I feel it's like, wait. <laughs> Be mindful who you're dating, guys. Oh, my goodness. Make sure you check their blood type and all those things. Though. That's true. I don't even know my own blood type, bro. You sick yourself and get no joke. Word. Do you know your blood type? No. I will find out one day. It's got to be like O something. Yeah. I'm going to say O positive because I'm a positive person. Get out. <laughs> Get in the bin right now. <laughs> right now. Hey, man, you got to try sometime. You got to try sometime. No, you don't. <laughs> <laughs> what, what are you saying? Though? What are you saying? I was just going to talk about like, what's your favorite film that you've seen in the, in recently? Favorite film I've seen recently. Yeah, I'm not talking about like, uh, like you know we were, we weren't positive about like Doctor Strange. Let's bring some positive. What's a film you've enjoyed that you see recently? It could be old, new, whatever. You know, one of my favorite films is City of God, and I've been trying to find it for the longest because I think it was on Netflix, mm-hmm. but I don't think it's on Netflix anymore. Yeah, here they do that shit. But that film is cold. That is one of my favorite films, and it's not even an English film. No, that stuff to be all time. I mean, like recently that you see. Mm. Um. I'm trying to remember the last film I actually watched because I've been trying. I've been watching a lot of series recently. Oh, you can do series as well. Um, well, I just I just started Queen of South again because there's new episodes out. So I just started that. That one's it's good, but you know when the characters are so dumb, yeah. like this is cartel business. You can't be mixing love and cartel. <laughs> it doesn't make sense. Business, business and pleasure. Huh? Exactly, bro. But um, I'd say one series that I've watched recently, and. It's really good. I'm going to say Ozark, you know. That's a good series. Did you finish it? Uh, y- 
Yes. Okay, what happened at the end? Um, she killed my man. She Is killed the the Spanish don. Um, the guys. Or Ruth. Yeah, Ruth killed him. Okay, spoilers, spoilers, spoilers. Yeah, and then it's been like a week and a bit since I've watched it. I can't really remember. Yeah, because he died a very long time ago. Oh, is it? So I'm not done. I'm just wait. I want you to feel it. It's like an episode or two after that. That's what I've got. Yeah, you've got like four more to go. Oh my gosh, I thought I was done. (laughs) I thought I was done. I was like, you is because that's the start of the second part of season. Oh, is it? Yeah. Okay, yeah. Then I need to watch the second part of season four then. But Second you know. part's good to be fair. I re- I don't know. It's I can see why people complain about the ending, mm. but it's like they're white people, so I get why they ended like that. But yeah, that's you know, just tell me what happened at the end. Nah, I don't want to. Fair enough. Actually, yeah. uh, if you want, do you want to? Uh, just give me. A, real, give it's me. Pre- it's, it's, is it predictable? It's, can't you? You expect more. There's there's things that happen in between that are like, mm-hmm. but like okay. The, the main thing is they get away scot free, pretty much. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Now, fair enough. Yeah, I, th- I thought that. I thought that happened anyways. Like no one in the family does. Yeah. Fair enough. I I, I literally thought that happened. So that's cool. Yeah. Um. Because you know how like the way they were, I think they the promotional trailers they were showing that they were driving the caravan and all the van or whatever. And oh yeah and yeah crashed. yeah yeah yeah. I've watched. So, yeah, I've watched the first episode. Yeah, that I think happens. First episode. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That yeah, yeah, happens yeah. in it, but they, they come out fine. So yeah, that's pretty much what happened in Ozark. But for me, I just saw Parasite. That film is fucking cold. I've been meaning to watch it. People, someone told me to watch it. That film is that, cold. That and um, Apocalypto. Yeah, I haven't, I haven't seen that. No, the Parasite Par- film. That is that is one of the best movies I've ever made. Where is it? It's on Amazon Prime. Amazon Prime, yeah. Yeah. All right, cool. I watched because people were saying it like two years ago when it came out. Like, no, nah, this is the best movie. Because I've heard of it. I'll be real. It lives up to the hype. Who's like, in it? No, it's um, a Korean film. Oh, it's Korean. Yeah. Oh, okay. So enough. it's none of that star. Oh, it, was stuff. it was it after Squid Game? No, it's way. It was before that. Was oh, okay. Because there was something that came out after Squid Game, and people were saying, "Oh, this is wavy as well." I was like, "Oh, I lie, man." You yeah, that was. Um, oh no. You know what I'm talking about, yeah. isn't it? It's, yeah, it yeah, was yeah, kind yeah. of like Squid Games, but now this is like, I don't really want to talk about the plot, but like right. it's it's a proper film. Like you know, there was where what, like what, what genre? Uh, I'll say thriller. Okay, that's wavy. Thriller's right up my street, bro. That's yeah. you know what it is. I think. People blur the line sometimes between thriller and horror because you can have a horror that's not a thriller, yeah. but you can have a horror, horror that is a thriller. Yeah, yeah. I, love, I love a good thriller. I'm not really into horror like that, but no, nah, I'm it. not into like just. The <laughs> 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 uh, I like the horrors that are like thrillers where it's like there's an actual plot and it's not just like oh this is possessed. Oh, mm. they're haunting them. Do you know what I mean? Yeah. I, it's just dumb. If there's a thriller and there's some sort of actual plot to the story and can you can't then yeah, I like it. Yeah, it's a parasite. Like, the amount of twists were, that were in it, it was just like... At first, I thought, okay, I know where this is going. And then there was a twist. You're making me hungry. And then there was another twist. And then there was, like, another twist. You're making me hungry. Stop talking. And then you think there's a happy ending. And then there's a twist after that. Should we just put it on and just review it for the whole pod? I'm done. <laughs> <laughs> I want to watch that again. Because there were certain things where it was like, they were hinting at it. Mm. Like, oh, I want to say this. Okay, let me say this bit. It's not going to... It's, it's not a spoiler, is it? It kind of is. Okay, don't say it. Don't say it. Don't, don't say it. From a okay, basically, <laughs> okay, I'll get, I'm not gonna say the characters, but when you watch it, you'll probably get who it is. Don't spoil but, it though. Uh, Don't spoil it, bro. I'll throw my shoe at you, big man thing. I just said uh, I'm gonna go watch it. <laughs> all I'll say, can, all can I'll you say, see, guys? Like, all I'll say is, someone, bro, why they, are you talking? No, 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 they think, <laughs> they think <laughs> someone's crazy, but they're not actually crazy. Oh my gosh. Man tries to cover his ears, but he's is it? the headphones <laughs> on. <laughs> 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 So he was gonna hear. Yeah, I was, exactly. so I, was, I was gonna hear it louder, bro. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, all I was gonna say is there's, there's someone who they think is crazy, but he's not actually crazy. Big man thing. I just bleeped it in my head. Bleeped it. Yeah, exactly, bro. Beep, beep, beep. Nah, that's a cold. That is a very cold film. I saw The Departed recently as well. Oh, The Departed's cold. Yeah, yeah, yeah. that's a cold film. Yeah, yeah. Do you know? What? Hold on. Let me ask you this. Mm-hmm. What would you say is your top three series of all time? Series. Series. Because I have this one series. Yeah. It's, it's so amazing. I think it's in everyone's top three. I'll say The Office. Oh, we're talking about like serious, serious. Man said, I'm talking about the greatest series of all time. A man says The Office. Yes. What the hell? The, is, the, are you skunked, bro? What's going on? This guy was to say Friends. Love it. The I, office, was, I was uh, never going to say Friends. I'll say The Office. 
He's gonna say bad. You're gonna say it's always sunny in Philadelphia, isn't it? That's where it's cold. That's where it's freaking hilarious. You made my point, anyways. Breaking Bad, I think, is is so so good. Yeah. Break, the Breaking Bad's Apart like, from the last episode. Breaking Bad... No, I like that last episode. The ending? The, yeah, I liked it. No. Mm, you think it's, it was just completed too much? No, no, no. It was a good ending, but it's like, ugh, I just wanted a bit more. Yeah. I'll say the first two seasons of Lost. Oh, my gosh. That is some of the best television ever. I think I've watched the first. I don't think I've watched the second. The first two seasons are freaking phenomenal. But, um, yeah, those will be my top three, probably. Or Bojack Horseman. Might be my third. If I had to give a definitive one. Quality show. Have you watched I've it? Tried to. Yeah, did did. It, I wasn't. I wasn't able to get into it. Yeah, you did get to the actual show. The first season's like. That's what I mean. Like, people into Rick and Morty. No, no, no. See what I mean. The like, first season can, pulls you in. How can how then, can how can it be like like who was it? That said? I think it, it was you that said it yeah. about the Office. About the first season, like it's dry. No, the first season's a remake of the UK one, and then oh, the second man. season's when they find themselves. Like if 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 it's a good show, it should just be good. No, 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 no. Listen, listen, listen. I'm saying, I'm not saying good from the pilot, mm. but from the first season. By the no, end of the I first didn't. season, I should be like, okay, there's that's something I can deal with here. And then the second season, it gets better. It should no, be I like because when you think about something like Breaking Bad, first season was quality. Mm. Nah, it's not. It's not the best season in 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 the six no, the first or five. It's five. The first two seasons, I didn't really enjoy it like that. No, no, the first season was good. The first season was good. The second season... No, but do you know why I didn't enjoy it like that? Because, like, you know there was, like, a lot of, like, panned shots where it would just be, like... Remember that episode when um, Jesse's old girlfriend was tripping on um, hallucinogens? Mm-hmm. And it was, like, a good 15 minutes of her just tripping. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. And then yeah, yeah. there would be another scene where it's, like, four minutes of them just in the desert. Yeah, yeah, I know. No, I know or what just mean. the desert. So yeah, that's yeah, yeah. why I say like it's like one of those ones where it's like if you have a short attention span, oh my! If, no, you, have a short, if you have a short attention span, yeah, then Breaking Bad it would be harder so, harder for you to get into. But I give a lot, I give a lot of shows that leeway in terms of if I can see there are a couple minimum rules and people say the latest seasons are good, I'll keep watching. Mm-hmm. Yeah, mm-hmm. but if I see bad things, I'm not watching anymore. I hear that. So, for example, I Bojack Horseman, that. I saw there was a little minimum rules where I was like, oh, this is kind of an interesting show, mm. and then it just kept going. I don't know, I think I got three episodes in and I was like... Yeah, the first three episodes are like, I was like normal adult... I was, try, I was trying to give it a chance because I've heard people say it's very good. Mm. But I was just like... Now nah, you got to get to like season... you got to finish season two and then you're like, no, nah, this, this show is amazing. You see, that, that's a bit too much time commitment, bro. It's when you think, like 20 minute purpose. But still, when you think you, about... No, you could watch it... What I'll say is watch it like background stuff mm-hmm. and then... Oh, and then actually get into it. And then you realise like, oh shit... This is quality, and then you mm. watch it. And you watch it again, mm. but you pay attention, and then you it'll just open up so many things. And you just keep finding out new things. Cause I watched it like five, six times. That's what's. I watch it. I watch it whilst I'm editing this video. Then it's fine. No, trust me. When when you watch it like just as background stuff, you'll be like, okay, I can have mm. a couple funny jokes. That's cool, but because like, when I'm thinking like when I'm thinking of like my greatest and in, in no order in particular, I'm thinking Breaking Bad. See now, I would have said Prison Break, but the latter. I'll say seasons, I'll say Lost is better than Prison Break. The first two seasons of Lost are better than Prison Break. I'm not happy with it. Then the whole thing of the first two seasons of Prison Break. Are you saying that Lost first two seasons? Yeah, and Prison Break's first two seasons. You're skunked. You're you are lost. 100%. You're lost. Do you know why? Because the characters in Lost, they're actual like the first season the way they develop them. I've never seen a TV show do it that well. Like every like, hey, what? I'll give it, I'll give it, I'll give it a chance in terms watch of it again, like watch watching it again because I watched the first season, mm. but I haven't watched the second. Now the second season is quality as well. Fair enough. It get it gets terrible like after like, but the fourth. What I will say, Prison Break, that first season, is hands down anyone can anyone can argue with me. So I don't give a damn. Prison Break's first season is one of the greatest first seasons I think I've actually I'll ever seen. I'll say Lost's first season is better, but... No, I'm, I'm not going to say it's the greatest, but I'm saying it's one of the greatest. Yeah, 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 no. In terms of, like, you're thinking, oh, this guy's smart, and then things exactly. go wrong. And then I, he figures it out, and then it goes wrong again. Ex- and it's like, how on earth is he going to do... And, and there's a point where it's like, nah, he's not going to get out of this. And there's, there's even character development in there. Think about Sucre. Yeah. yeah. Mm. Think about it. Even Teabag. Mm, no, not Teabag. Um, what's my man's name? Um, I'll, I'll oh. say characters. The black develop. guy. The black guy. I'll say characters develop after the first season. But it, no, you know, it's, it's not. It's not a thing where it's like, oh, in the first three episodes they're like this, and in the last three episodes of the no, season I'm saying, they're completely I'm saying, different. Um, I'm saying in terms of flushing characters out, lost the way it does it is just fucking phenomenal. 
Like, uh-huh. have flashbacks, and then, like, you'll see why they act the way they do on the island based on the flashback. This is just too Yeah, cool. no, Prison Break does that same thing as well because it was, like, wh- no, with the black Break guy. Fl- flashbacks, but it was, like... It wasn't in the first season. It was in, like, the second or third. Yeah, they were adding it on. There, like there, there was a few in the first because it showed, like, flashbacks to how Lincoln got in, in prison. Yeah, but it was, like, as it relates to Michael's story, whereas, like, Lost is, like, the main 20 characters. Mm-hmm. It's all about their story. 20 main characters? Like, they, they start killing them off. <laughs> okay. But, like, in the first <laughs> It just se- sounds like a lot, But bro. in the first season, it's, like, 20 characters, let's say. Yeah. And then, like, as the season goes on, a couple die, a couple get kidnapped, and you don't see them for, like, six episodes. But, like, you bond with all of them, pretty much. Wait, who, who the fuck are getting kidnapped, kidnapped by? So they're on the island alone? No, no, no. There were, there were people there. It's oh, okay. Like, pirates and that? No, just, like... I'm not gonna spoil it, but there were there were people indigenous there. people. Let's just say that people that are indigenous. allegedly, yeah. Okay, cool, fair enough. But yeah, there were people. All right, there. interesting. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But Prison Break, Prison Break, in terms of the story, like it was Prison Break was cold because of Michael. Where I was lost is cold because everyone is just like doing their own thing, trying to survive. What would you do in that situation? Mm. I what, I hear what? that. I hear that. Whereas like Prison Break is kind of it like doesn't make my top three. Because of the way it fell off later on in the show. Well, Prison Break. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. That's why it doesn't mean that first three, but I had to give it, give the first two seasons an honourable mention. Yeah, I heard that. Um, so what's your top three then? I know Breaking Bad's in Breaking there. Bad, I would say... You know, I'd probably still say Game of Thrones, even though the last two episodes were us. Yeah, but I'll say for Game of um, Thrones that... Um, I swear they started writing it themselves. Um, the last season, yeah. Yeah, so I don't, I don't personally. That's I that's what pissed me off. I won't um count that against them type thing. Mm. Obviously, it affects the show, but like. But the thing is, it, it left they, it left so many loose ends, bro. Yeah, that, that I hate. That, that, that that's why know. I was so pissed off mm. because for the writer to finish the book, they said it'll be an extra nine months. Yeah. But because there was so much hype around it, they're like, nah, nah, nah we got. And you know, it was now. where the money that they're gonna make from like releasing this. Exactly. Like when when it was funny because there was a compilation of them asking the actors about how they felt about the final scene, mm. and some of them were just laughing. Some of them were like, "We shot like three, four different final scenes, so we don't actually know what's gonna happen until it comes out." And it made no sense. But for up until from season one to seven, mm. that show was. I think I was actually thinking this could be the greatest thing I've ever watched. No, I did it. Because it w- no, 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 because I was thinking it was so many like like you said, there's so many twists, character development. Even when they brought in new characters later on, the development... Oh, my gosh. Nah. Ramsey Bolton, his his character... I can't remember the, the guy's name, but I'm going to find his name. Mm. That guy, he played that character so, so well. And what made it even better for me is that I watched him in, in Between Us. Um, what? In Misfits. Sorry. Um, I saw him in Misfits. And his character was like, you know, the shy kind of weird guy who later on, you know, came out of the show and was like sort of like a superhero. Um... But in Game of Thrones, it's like when you when it's like when you finally see an actor has range. Yeah. I was like, yo, I was like, okay, so this guy can play a shit, like a bad boy actor. I was like, alright, cool. I'm not gonna say he's like one of the greatest actors or anything, but if you see that those two shows, if you watch Misfits and then you watch Game of Thrones, mm. and you just focus on his characters, you think this guy is an amazing actor, and I think he actually is. Uh, it's a shame I can't remember his name right now, but yeah, Game of Thrones is there. And then I think for the third spot, um, I don't even know, you know. I've watched a lot of rubbish. Third is... Uh, third is... Power could have been in there. Power's actually a decent shout, you know. It could have been, but it's not. Bar the last three episodes where they were doing... Guess That's who? an episode, the last three seasons, bro. No, but l- you know the last three episodes in particular where they were saying, guess who? Now, that and was going back to the season, the... like, oh my gosh. Oh, that was, that was a whole season, isn't it? Yeah, 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 yeah. You so, thought it was Tate, and then you thought it was Toby. Like, yeah, oh, yeah, yeah, that pissed me off. Was... If they did it for like an episode or two, max, yeah. I could hear it. I could hear it. No, but it was, like, it, was like, the, it was like... That was the best one out of a couple. Because like the fifth, fourth season... I was like, this show is rubbed. And then the sixth season, because everyone was like, no, nah, this is the final one. Let's all talk mm. about it. I was like, yeah, this <gasps> Sorry, I'm not even putting power there. I'll put what I just watched now, The Last Kingdom. That show is fucking cold. Have you watched it? Yeah, go watch that on Netflix. Oh, I told you I'm not into this Viking stuff. No, anymore. big man, li- watch the show. Watch the show. It's, it's cold. Stuff, yeah. No, I'm being dead serious. It's cold. And you know what? I'd even go to say that 
No, it's not. Ugh, is it better than Game of Thrones? I don't even know. It might be. In terms of ending, the way you end the show, mm. the way they ended Last Kingdom, that's how you end the show. Dude. Like, it, it's one of those ones where it was like, it was unexpected. Mm. It didn't leave any loose ends. Mm. There wasn't any sort of like, oh, but what about my man? And what about him? And it was good. It, nah, that show, bro, even though I only watched it last month, I could watch it again. But I'm not a nitty, so I'm not going to do that. No. But it's a great show. I like rewatching shows, to be fair. Yeah, but you know you have to leave, there's a the probation of time. Yeah, you have like, because sometimes, like, you know exactly what's going to happen. It's too soon. Or when it's, like, a two-year break. You, exactly. It's like, oh, shit, I didn't even remember. Da, 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 da. Mm-hmm. Can like, you see? Break, um, oh, you know, what was it? So I think I forgot that that kid, um, you know the one that T-Bag was going to, um, rape or whatever. Oh, Twina! Yeah. yeah, yeah. <laughs> and he was singing. I forgot about that bit. That scene is cold, bro. That's a cold and then I forgot scene. that he hung himself, trigger warden. Um, I don't know why I keep saying things after I've said the thing. But yeah, I forgot that he um, did that. And then, um, there's just bad things I forgot. Nah, nah. I forgot about the guy and his, um, the million that he had. P, what was it? PK, PK Kirkland? I don't know. Who? You know the guy? The oh, you're going to say PK Humble, bro. <laughs> <laughs> What are you talking about, bro? <laughs> nah, you know that guy? Um, oh, the old man? Yeah, the old okay, man. Okay, yeah, 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 yeah. I know, I know what you're talking about. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But yeah, those are bad things. And then when um, they went to that... You know, by the way, you know he's a real character. Like, that is based off of someone in real life. Oh, is it? Yeah, 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 yeah. That's but yeah, go on. But yeah, there was just hella things that I just forgot about. And then when I watched it, I was like, oh, yeah, that happened. And then sometimes you forget how the twist happens. And, and that's why I am that's why I was going to watch Breaking Bad last week, but I said, nah, I watched it last year during quarantine. Yeah. Uh, quarantine? Uh, whatever it's called, bro. Lockdown. Yeah. Um. Yeah. <laughs> like me didn't get COVID, man. Yeah, I'm good. But yeah, during lockdown, I watched it and I was yeah. So it's too soon. I have to give it like another year or two. But um, yeah. That is that little incubation incubation period. But yeah, if you guys haven't watched it, go and watch The Last Kingdom on Netflix. It's still there. It's let me, like let me check on it. It's five seasons. I think each season is about ten episodes long. It's definitely definitely worth it, especially if you like. Um, even if you don't like the Viking stuff. It's a it's it's a bit of a different twist on it. I'm not sure like it's a Mad Men. I don't know. It was okay. Like, well, hear what I say. It, the reason I say it's okay is because I I watched it in passing when my sisters and that were watching it. No, it's, it's, one, I mean? it's one of those ones you have to like. It's like it's like Sex in the City. No, Mad Men's clear, bro. No, 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 no. I'm saying it's like Sex in the City. The way like. Oh no! In terms of the way you consume. Yeah. yeah, I get what you're saying, but no, Mad Men's clear, man. Or even like the way I actually consumed Prison Break when it was first out. Because when it was first out, I remember being in my cousin's house watching it in passing. So that's why I the name Michael Schofield always stuck with me because I remembered his character. And I said, oh yeah, Prison Break, I thought, let, me go, let me watch it. And I watched it in full for the first time and I was like, oh, okay, I see. <laughs> I heard it. A show that fell off that was designated. No, I didn't fall off. But you know, that show was really cold. It then. was so good. And then, like, the third season where they started swearing and... I don't know. It wasn't bad, but it went from, like, an eight to, so like, like, a, a six, six and a yeah, half. Yeah, yeah. yeah. It just wasn't... And then it got cancelled. Yeah. And did you, did you hear why it got cancelled? So, the next... So, I think it got cancelled on season three. Oh, because it was the COVID... Like, they were going to do, like, virus-related stuff. They were going to do COVID and they were going to basically mirror the way in which Trump ha- handled COVID. Yeah. And apparently, like... Er- so, so they've shot it. Like, the whole season's there, but apparently they stepped in and said, yeah, you can't do this. Like, we're shutting this shit down. Yeah, because um, that happened with the Falcon and Winter Soldier. Oh, yeah. Because you know... Do you, have you seen it? Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know that um, that girl who was... Um, like, she was an immigrant. I think she was an immigrant or something. And then they were going to... You know the super-powered one, I think? I'm trying, to re- I'm trying to remember the film first, and then I'm trying to remember. That's a TV show. On Disney Plus. Oh, I thought you were talking about the Winter Soldier film. No, no, no. The Falcon and the Winter Soldier. Oh, the si- oh, oh, yeah, oh, yeah. yeah. No, I watched the first few episodes and then I gave up. Sorry. Yeah, basically, the reason it was kind of bad is because, like, they were meant to do, like, the per- the villain was meant to release, like, a virus. Because you know how Thanos clicked half the universe out? Mm-hmm. So some people would, like, move to another country, help oh. rebuild. But then when everyone came back, people were, like... Coming back sick and that. Or what? No, people were coming back, but then people were like, bro, why are these immigrants here? Why? Oh, in, in the rich yeah, neighbourhood, yeah, yeah, so they yeah, were like, yeah, get yeah. back. 
And then people are like, no, you can't do that to us. So then what the villain was going to do is release a virus so that those people can stay where they were type thing. Okay, fair but, enough. Um, obviously because of COVID. And the, at the time, I think it was released in the first pandemic, the show. If they released that virus thing, Disney's behind all of it. Duh, 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 duh. So they're like, nah, we're going to have third eye. <laughs> it's, remember when people were saying it's because of the 5G? Yeah, I still do. How would... Sort of and then they brought up these dumb videos on YouTube from 12 years ago. Our professors talking about 5G and this and that. Same niggas that will tell you that they will, they will show the pictures of someone sleeping with a phone underneath their pillow and then the pictures of them in the morning. Who the, who the, who the fuck? Who's, who's, who's taking the picture beforehand and after? Explosion, bro. <laughs> Stupidness, bro. No. Yeah, no. Um, yeah, no. Designated like, Survival was good. That first season was class. Um, oh, another good show is there. Ooh. Homeland, Homeland, that was a good I show. Seen that. that was a good show. That's where the meme comes from. That oh, math yeah, one. Math <laughs> yeah, no, that that show was good. Um, I might watch that again actually because it's it's quite lengthy. I want to watch um, House of Cards, but I feel guilty sometimes. Oh, because of uh, my man. Kevin Spacey, yeah. Yeah. Because I watch um, Baby Driver. That's one of my favorite films. <laughs> it's so cut, so cool film. Can't remember. I don't know what you're talking about. Baby Driver. I don't know how Jamie Foxx is in it. That's pretty. Much, I don't know how else to describe it. Oh, no. It's just about a getaway driver. Okay, fair enough. And Kevin Spacey, it's one of the coldest films I've ever made. But, um, Wait, did he get arrested? Kevin Spacey? In the end, yeah. He's in prison, I think. He's in prison? Yeah. Oh, okay, cool, cool, cool. Because I, I heard about the, the whole scandal and yeah, why he got cancelled from Disney, um, from House of Cards. Yeah, he of the other actors f- of their bag because of my man. So what, you think that the art should live on type thing? Yeah, like, even, so there's things where, obviously, it's a th- obviously if it was like he was, um, if he was doing something similar, or no, not similar, because um, he was like what touching young boys or something like that, innit? Trigger warning. I don't even know. Um, I, 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 I lost because I, I did basically what you did. Yeah, I yeah. said it and then said trigger warning. But yeah, so I think it was something like that or molesting or yeah, whatever sort of shangala. So if he was doing something where it was like in the show he was caught sleeping with the babysitter or something like that. As in like, you know how in these American shows where like the wife goes away and then... Oh, well, like Scandal. Like he's having an affair. Yeah, like like an affair. Like he's having an affair with like the babysitter where the babysitter yeah. is like eighteen or seventeen. Do you know what I mean? Yeah. If it was something like that in the show, then I'd understand why. Okay, yeah, don't probably don't watch the show because if the affair is a big part of it, do you get what I'm trying to say? Oh, like a trigger that you've seen. Yeah. Okay. Like for example, like listening to R. Kelly's music where the guy's talking about. Oh, like he's referring to like the, the things he's doing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Whereas you're seeing that he he's like acting a completely different role. Yeah, yeah, exactly, do you know what I mean? I could still I could still appreciate the art, it doesn't mean I have to appreciate the person. Yeah, and yeah. that's why for me it's very, very easy for me to separate the art from the person. Like people ask me why I like the weekend so much. Yes, the guy is a bit of a weird guy and he goes through very like his personal life is emotionally scattered. It's a mess. But that music <laughs> Yeah, but he's not like... The guy makes... No, I, no, I haven't heard anything that's that controversial. No, 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 I'm not even talking about controversial, like anything controversial. I'm just talking about in general. Yeah, like, but I just assume everyone's on that in Hollywood. Mm. But but you get what I mean, though? Being able to separate, like... like do you think Drake has a done coke before, like... Oh, like, that nigga's done something. That, yeah, exactly. Damn niggas do everything. Yeah, exactly. Like, I just assume everyone's done, like... Exactly. Or, like, even... Who was it? Um, I was listening to Michael Jackson in the office, actually. Um, I'm trying to think about when it was. I was listening in the office and someone was like, oh, but haven't you seen the documentary? You might have bleeped. I think we've spoken about this before. Oh. No, but it's a point where it's like... I don't give a damn about that like, documentary. Who, who else could we make a game of? And it's like a successful game. Yeah. That, do you know how mad that is? Like we've, and bro, we've made even a, I don't think we could do that for Kanye West. No. A game, a game, bro. You're that packageable. You made a Wii game and it was a hit. That is wild. Bro, dogs do the moonwalk. Yeah, oh, no, that guy was clear. Like, but no, there's, the there's actually a video of a dog doing a moonwalk. They're, they're watching it on TV and he's doing the, with, his, with his tail and everything, with his four legs. Yeah, but there's certain people, like, in history, like, it's genuinely, you can't, there's some people you, you can't. just can't erase, like. You can't. Oh, Kelly was, like, big, but, like, he was He wasn't culture. there yet. He was like, like, for example, Elvis Presley, apparently he's racist or whatever. Oh, yeah. Well, there's racist stuff about him. <laughs> apparently. The guy's a white American in the 50s. What do you but, think? Like, you can't rub him out. Like, generally speaking, like, even if we don't listen to him, mm-hmm. culture-wise, you just can't rub him out. So it's a bit... Uh-huh. <laughs> so, <laughs> look, 
the guy is long past our time. What's the deal with reference? Yeah, yeah, exactly. Like he he died way before I was born, and when I was younger, I knew like, I knew about him. Yeah. Do you know what I mean? He's one. Of, he's one of those people. It's like, yeah, you can't rub him out. It's like, even, for example, God forbid, God forbid. But if someone like Snoop Dogg was to die, mm. it'd be the same thing. Or like, say something came up about Snoop Dogg. Yeah. His he'd still live on. Do you know what I mean? Like even Dr. Dre, like... To an extent. Only because of... I think only because of, like, Beats and a couple of nah, other stuff. NWA. NWA certified him. But... And that film as it's, well. No, no, it's certified, but it's not as... It's not as, um... How can I say Him it? and Ice Cube are clear, real. Oh, no, no, no. They're clear, undeniably. Yeah. But I'm saying the way Snoop Dogg's been able to market himself... No, I'm not comparing him to Snoop. I'm just saying, oh, like, okay, in okay, terms okay, of okay, being okay. stamped, like, no matter what the allegation is, this person is not gonna, like... Even Drake. CR7 even. Yeah, it's CR7. CR7. CR7's a big one. What? Yeah. They've been trying to get this guy down for rape for ages. Yeah, apparently you can't go to the US or else he's going straight to prison. No, you can go US. He was there, I saw he was there last year. I don't know. That's what I've, heard. I've heard that's where his case is. And you know the ones where as soon as you like... I don't know. I, I don't know. But it was what. in... It, was, it happened in England though. Because this I is when know. he was in Manchester. Like n- like fresh Manchester. I don't. Know, I just heard this. I just heard someone said someone that you know. That yeah. Appara- apparently, when he was out with like Neville and them, man, that's yeah. where he met the girl in the club, and apparently that's where the rape took place. Or yeah. I don't know if it took place there or later on. I don't. I don't, I don't know. I don't know the crooks of this detail. Do you know what I mean? But still, I don't think. Yeah, that, that nigga's allowed everywhere, man. It's CR7, bro. Yeah, but yeah, guys, guys, got almost 500, 500 million followers on Instagram. That's what? Crazy. And you're telling me he's not allowed in America? Please. Yeah. Guy, guy can go where the fuck he wants, bro. But apparently that's why he didn't go to um, Inter Miami. Nah, nah, nah. nah. That's, that's hit. The reason he didn't do that was his pride. He knows damn well that if he goes there, what's he going to go win? That's worth his winning. Zlatan came back. <laughs> he's, but Zlatan, I think Zlatan... thing is, Zlatan likes to... I think he likes to portray himself as this lion. This he wa- he wants to be like a Ragnar Lothbrok. Yeah. He wants to be like a you know like a great. I don't even know what that means. Right? Right, I'll tell you afterwards. But I don't think he's that guy. He is to an extent in terms of a great leadership and whatever. Mm. But going to the MLS, I think he just did it to secure the bag, and like he was just done. And he was like, you know what? I scored like thirty five goals this season, bro. Mm. I can let me let me go back to Milan. Let me yeah, go he back. A for that. Yep. Yeah, he completed that league. So. Completed it, bro. Do you know what I mean? Like, he just said, yeah, oof, I'm a bit lazy. Like, a season after, he said, yeah, you know what? I want to come back. And I think people are calling him washed as well. Because, mm-hmm. like, once you go to the MLS, it's like, you're washed. And he was a bit slow as well. He still is, but... Yeah, but apparently the guy actually played this whole season with no ACL. Yeah, which is crazy. He said he had to... Em- like, he, there was an interview he did. He said he had to empty out his knee every every week Damn. or twice a week yeah. he said that he had to take painkillers every day for the last nine months you know his stomach is fucked if he didn't win a trophy he would have been pissed. he would have started knocking heads <laughs> he but did you see his um his uh speech in the changing room after the scudetto that was like three four minutes i'm not watching that really. no i'm not gonna, no it was it was it was like a minute and a half speech Dude. and then the rest of it was just a celebration oh, okay, and cool. be on, be yeah. no, no no but that speech one, you can tell everyone respects him, mm. and two, you can actually. I mean, he's old enough to be certain people's dads, bro. Yeah, no, 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 no. I'm, I'm saying not respecting in terms of age, but I'm saying respect him as in like. As a man, bro. Yeah, just like okay, yeah, like I'm not even gonna because you know when bro, they've just won their first cadetto in I think eleven years. Yeah. You know, and this is in the midst of celebration. He said, "Stop, stop talking." Didn't hear him, and I don't think he is he captain. Might be captain. I'm not sure. And he said, I'll, I'll double check that. But I don't I think. Like one of the center, I don't think he is captain. But anyways, yeah. You correct me if I'm wrong. Midway. Mm. But yeah, I don't think he's even captain. So when he was talking, and it was a thing where like even the press, the photographers, everything, like they weren't making a sound, mm. a single sound. It was so quiet, bro. It was so quiet you could hear the <coughs> of the studs when he was walking. Yeah, because you know that ones where you know it's gonna be a sound bite type thing. Like this is gonna be. Something that people remember. Yeah. Time. And then he flipped the table at the end. <laughs> Literally, no, flipped the table, almost hit the photographer. <laughs> and then they all started singing and roaring and all them things there. But yeah, is he is he captain? No, I wasn't checking. I wasn't 
I don't know. Just looking at next topics, I wasn't checking. But yeah, nah, it's yeah. I don't know. It could be could have been one of those things. But one thing I do want to say, I don't want to make it a topic because we could be here for hours because I I feel quite passionate about this. But I I just want to say because I know we've got American listeners. Um, I just want to pay respects to those that died in that school shot in that yeah. school shooting. No, I don't really want to get into it because it's a bit of a long winded topic, and I don't. I I yeah I don't really. Do, that, do you know what I mean? And obviously that man's got like a bit of family over there and everything. And yeah. I'm just thinking, like, imagine if that happened in where they're staying. And do you know what I mean? Because yeah. they got kids and everything. But it didn't even have to be like that because school shoot, like, bro, they just need to fix that country because they had flipping Biden tweeting, uh, tweeting on Twitter saying, oh, it's unacceptable. Nigga, you're the president. Like, you could just, like, whatever, change, you, change whatever, it. You, whatever you do, it doesn't necessarily have to um, change it doesn't have to necessarily be the most effective it doesn't have to rub it out completely try, at least try something it doesn't have to rub it out completely but at least mit- mitigation yeah I, like, like i think i saw make japan, it less accessible do you know what i mean like japan what they do is like they do like a police interview a police officer interviews you you do a psych test your family and friends have to like cooperate that you're like sane to actually own a gun like big man and go oh man go get ak-47 <laughs> How can I go Walmart and say, yeah, let me get some, uh, let me get some Oreos, let me get some Cheetos, pack of um, smokes. pack of smokes, and uh, you know what that that Glock, that Glock look good. Should I get a Glock or the uh, Desert Eagle looks pretty good, but it's a uh, it's a bit of a packer, isn't it? <laughs> what? Nah, sorry, impossible, impossible. And that's one. That's like, yeah, impossible. Next topic. I don't want to spend too much energy on this one. We'll talk about it yeah, another time, bro. Do- Yes, guys. So I don't know if you guys remember, but I said I was going to put in a new segment where I was just going to read funny stuff in it. And um, like all like all good, you know, content creators or whatnot, I forgot. <laughs> I forgot I, I forgot the week after. But then I said to myself, OK, no, mid-age, you know, if you want to do this segment properly, you actually have to get a proper topic. Mm. Do you know what I mean? You have to get a proper topic down and whatnot. So I think what I'm going to do is a mixture of Reddit and Twitter mm. because... Reddit, you need to filter out quite a lot more than you need to filter out Twitter. Cool. So I'm going to read um, some red flags. Yeah. Any name from, for this um, segment? For this segment? No, you know what? Yeah, just just laugh with mids, innit? Like, that's what I'm going to say. Just laugh with mids, fam. Okay. Just come out here and laugh with mids. Simple as. Just yeah? See how, see how I combine the brand and them things there? No? Working title. <laughs> <laughs> working progress, working progress. All right, cool. Cool. So I'm going <laughs> to... I'm going to read some of the women ones, yeah? Mm. And I'm not going to lie to you. Some of these, like, really, really made me laugh. This one said she's always the victim in her stories and never the villain or the one who fucked things up. Mm. And I'm not going to lie to you. It's very true, you know? Because imagine, yeah, you're going with a, you're going out with a girl and she's talking about her ex for some reason mm. and she's saying about, oh, how he did this to me, like, yeah, he cheated on me. Well, this I ex think it's cheated worse on when me. you know the person and, like, you know they... They have faults of their own, but oh. somehow everything, it's just like... Mm. But, and it's always like, oh, it's this person, like, oh, I don't know how they cheated on me. But, like, bro, it's all, I'm not going to lie to you. I'm not going to I'm not gonna say this because saying it for everyone is, is wrong. But if you're going out with a girl and you, like, obviously when you're going out with someone, no one's perfect. They're going to have, like, their flaws or whatever. But if she's been cheated on too many times, you guys don't think she's the problem, bro. Like, no. what led these... No, no, no. Hear me out. Hear me out. Hear me out. What led these guys to cheat on you? So you're he- back you hear to it. Back to back to so back. I'm not saying I hear it. Okay, I'm okay, not... Okay. <laughs> I said I hear it. No. Said, I'm not saying I hear it, said, but I'm saying like... What's, what's similar to all these situations? You know, exactly. <laughs> what's the common denominator, yeah. bro? There's yeah. something... Like, you need to take some time and focus on yourself. Because if... No, 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 no. Hear me out. Hear me out. If she's been cheated on five times, back to back to back to back to back, she's 0 for 5. That's a poor field goal, bro. Oh That's a poor f- field goal percentage, fam. So you're, so you're hearing them under the... I'm not saying I hear them out. I'm not saying I hear them out. They're wrong for cheating, but at the same time, you need to do a bit of self-reflecting. Yeah, no, you're, uh, you're it makes sense. <laughs> you're going to have to die this hill on your own. All right, cool, cool, cool. The next one I'll say, yeah, is that someone who goes through a lot of best friends and always loses them to fall, that, falls that's, out. That is definitely a red flag. That is 100%. A new best friend every other month? That is a red flag. Oh my God, she's my bestie. You're going to do brunch, blah, blah. No, especially if they're like close. 
Like these people, are, bro. But you know how I hear that. You one. know how quickly girls make friends, though. No, no, I'm talking about like, let's say they were, they were close for like four or five years, and then she finds a new one, and then another two years finds a new one, then another two years finds a new one. It doesn't have to be years, bro. It's just like. I don't, I don't know, bro. Or just months. Like, why do people keep cutting you off like this? <laughs> especially, yeah. especially people like you know the ones where you you see two people together and they're all yeah. together. One hundred percent. Why do these people keep leaving, bro? And then they'll have like healthy relationships. What's the common leave? denominator? Yeah. You niggas. I hate, I hate that. I hate that. It's one. the same thing with the cheating. No, 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 <laughs> no, 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 no. You're a villain. You're a villain. <laughs> This guy's a serial cheater, bro. <laughs> what? This guy's a serial cheater. cheater, bro. I have never, purely vag- I've never cheated. Bro. <laughs> I've never cheated in my life, man. I'm purely vag- <laughs> Hey, That video is jokes, bro. Nah, okay, cool. Another one here. And this one, I'll bug out behind closed doors. You'll never catch me bugging out in public. But if she makes fun of your biggest securities, biggest insecurities in front of other people for a laugh. Yeah, I don't tell women about insecurities. No, but I'm saying like, imagine this is a girl that is your like. No, two, no, this is your girl. No, no, two years no, deep. No, no, two no, years no, deep, no, and you're no, not open up. Impossible. Yeah, Impo- insecurities. There's more to me than about securities, bro. No, but I'm saying like two years deep, bro. No, just no. She's she's met the mod. She's met the sisters. No, insecurities, bro. N- bro, nothing good. I'm, nothing good comes from telling this person. No, but it's, it's opening up. It's trust, isn't it? Communication. Nothing good. Comes from telling or that, this or that, Oh, that's what they say. I mean, I, I'm with you on this, but I'm trying to... <laughs> good comes. <laughs> Nothing good comes. Are you sure? Nah, man. Nah, man. I tell her I have abandonment issues. She starts airing me. No. <laughs> <laughs> no. no. I'm fine, fix. I'm fine. I'm good. Man I'm said, good. oh, I'm back. Oh, you thought I abandoned you, innit? <laughs> oh, my gosh. I hear it, though. No. I hear what you mean. I'm not saying, like... I'll tell her what I'm not, I don't like... I'm not gonna tell you what my exact insecurity is. No, if you some people are mad, you know. Some people, oh, 100 percent Some people are bro, genuinely. Women are mad. <laughs> women are crazy. You stand, stand, so that, stand that on your own, but <laughs> what? I ain't agree with you. What do you mean? I ain't agree with you. With what? Women are mad, bro. You said that. You're your own. I'm not believing that. So <laughs> you said, oh, did I say that? Yeah. Oh. Hell. Uh <laughs> not believing it. So <laughs> that's staying in. So. Uh, leave it in, leave it in. I don't give a damn. Someone said, yeah, it's only been an hour and I've read six of these and my girlfriend has the moon. Should I break up with her now? <laughs> yes. <laughs> yes. Hey, someone, yes. Said he, someone said you should show her and be like, is this you? <laughs> That's hilarious. And then she'd be like, no. <laughs> but could you continue doing it? Leave. Oh my God, this is so Leave. mean. Leave immediately. <laughs> don't, even, don't even take your bag, bro. Don't even take your bag. All right, cool. The last one I'm going to read here, mm-hmm. and this one I feel like, um, you know, when I was talking about how everyone wants to be this, how I wants to have this toxic love and mm-hmm. kiniko, what sort of, yeah, she's trying to stir up drama just so the relationship can be fun. I hear that though. Depends what type of drama. I hear it. Okay. Elaborate, nigga. <laughs> but sometimes, like you know, when you're just going through life, like especially like as normal people, like yeah, sometimes. There isn't really anything interesting going on. Mm-hmm. As especially people with responsibilities as well. Mm-hmm. Like sometimes like genuinely like nothing like exciting happens. And sometimes some people do that to make the story in the head of the relationship. So, so you're going out with your girl? Yeah. Nine months or whatever. It's yeah. been a it's been a while, like you're solidified in a relationship. Yeah. And she comes to you talking about who's who's Keisha. No, did you see there's a line? No, no, that, but that's, <laughs> the, that's the drama I'm talking cheating, about. Cheating, no, cheating. That's the drama I'm talking about. If you accuse me of cheating. Or yeah. not even cheating, just like, I don't know, liking someone's photo. Or, or like, say, like, for example, you're coming to the studio. Yeah. And then say, for example, like, how we did last time where we stayed for a little bit, we were chatting with my man or whatever, mm-hmm. and then I dropped you off, like, over an hour after we finished. Yeah. And she's like, oh, you're with your side thing, weren't you? Blah, blah. That sort of drama. Mm-hmm. Oh no, you hear it, innit? No, but there's like video, you hear it. There's video, you want the thrill? No, but there's video evidence that we were here. No, no, not video evidence that we were chilling afterwards. Yeah, there was. Camera stopped. We're gonna have to stop vlogging. <laughs> <laughs> post show. <laughs> post, post show vlog. Yeah. yeah. Post show vlogs. Like. No, that could burn because we actually we actually do vibe out a little bit after the show. Exactly. So yeah, I hear that. Don't get me down with that. But still, bro, I'm just saying you haven't I'll done show like the real footage, bro. <laughs> no, but sometimes these cameras are still rolling. Are they? Sometimes. 
Oh well, she, I mean, she hasn't got she hasn't got the raw file. I'll send it. <laughs> no, you're gonna download it off of the cloud and if that's what it takes. <laughs> <laughs> but you get what I mean, though, isn't it? Yeah, that sort of drama mm-mm. and uh, someone no, like there's me. Like, there's funny things you could do, but like in terms of like cheat, I feel like cheating might be a bit too far. Nah, death might be a bit too far. Whoa, that's but definitely too far. What sort of dramas with death? She plays dead or something. Yeah, well, like, like she tries to fake her death. Well, I like, say someone died and then nah, nah, they didn't. Nah, nah. Oh, that's not even funny. I, I don't play with death. I know, so that's why I'm saying death's a bit too far. That's the furthest you can go. There ain't no coming back from that. <laughs> no. Think what else? You're saying, oh, everybody plays games. <laughs> yeah, the games think I hear it though. Nah, nah, it's like romanticizing being a psycho. That's another red flag. Mm. Oh, I'm crazy. Those, those ones don't open me don't open those me ones me. those ones no, don't have to bring trouble but they choose to bring trouble exactly yeah, yeah. I want problems <laughs> oh <wait. laughs> you know what you know better but you still want I to don't want peace like, yeah exactly like okay. why are you telling me you're a psycho no. I should find this out by accident yeah like I should no, be but, but that means she's not a true psycho she's just playing a part that's very true because this year was a real true psycho. Psychos just, they just, you know, them was they're calm and then they become, they they show themselves. You know the film American Psycho? I, I need to see that. Like, see the, uh, that's a classic. But yeah, like him, because he seems like he's normal to everyone else in the world. Mm-hmm. But that guy is losing the plot <laughs> behind the. <laughs> yeah, like that. I've actually, like, there are, there are people out there, there are girls out there. I don't know if Mandem do this and I hope not, but there are girls out there that'll be like, oh, yeah, like, I'm crazy. If you can't handle crazy, then that's fine. Like, I don't want you then. No, but get some guys are like, toxic and then... And we call those people idiots. Yeah. Because but I, I don't why know, should I you be suffering? I think it's better if a guy acts toxic than a girl acts toxic. 100%. So... Not I, better, but as in like... Yeah, I, I know what it, you mean. It adds a bit more edge to the guy. Whereas with yeah. a girl, it's like, that's not really attractive. It's not. <laughs> so what? I, like, because you think... If, using that example, because you mm. think I was out with someone else when I was at the studio. Yeah. You've now keyed my car. It's just like, why? See, I'm the type of person who'll be like, okay, well, I know it was you. Mm. And because I know, because you're crazy, you've, you've admitted to the charges. Yeah. You gotta go. <laughs> bro, you, yeah, you're gone already. As in, you're going downtown, bro. <laughs> no, I'm being serious. If someone ever did that to me, like, I'm fully getting arrested. That's vandalism, bro. I hear that. That is vandalism. Like, I don't play with that shit. It makes no sense. But yeah, that's 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 that segment done, and I'm glad we ended on that, cause yeah, I'm just saying like all that sort of drama stuff. I can't lie to you, I'm 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 kind of like I'm kind of above person, yeah. so I'm not even gonna like play into. I'm like, ah, shit, what are you doing? You bugging out in the corner or some shit. <laughs> Let me see what you'd say. What are you uh, saying, bro? <laughs> But yeah, that's that's that segment done. If you guys want me to do more of the Reddit ones or the Twitter ones, let me know. I'll go to Twitter next week, I think. But yeah, there's that. Playlist? Playlist. Um, yeah. So what song you been banging? I ain't putting any of that Kendrick stuff in there. You a hater. I'm not a hater. I got to like Purple Hearts. No. The second, the second, um... We'll speak about that next week. The second, yeah, we'll speak about it next week. The second, um, oh my head. The second disc is better than the first, in my mm. opinion. Fair enough. I the first you. disc has grown on me. Um, let me get Family Feud by Jay Z. Oh, I like that one. Family Feud. Do you know what it is? I think the tune that I've been banging this week, and it's only because. Someone mentioned it to me, mm. and I was like, "Oh yeah, let me go listen back to those tracks." I think it was when I think it was when J Two was here mm. when he was talking about the Bugsy Malone, um, and then we started talking about Chip and whatnot. Well. But I've been banging out "Coward" by Chip. Okay. That tune is cold. What? No. Mm-hmm. I said I'm not light skin, I'm not dark skin, but I'm somewhere in between. Yeah, I crush grime. Yes, I crush pop. I guess I'm somewhere in between. What? He's a goat. <laughs> no, he's cold though. He's cold though. But yeah, if you guys haven't listened to those tunes, make sure you go listen to them. They're updated every single week. They're updated before the episode comes out. How great is that? Yeah. So that means when you're on the weekend, you're a little drive and them things, they be like, oh, what? There's a new tune in here. Oh, the Out Cheer Man then blessed us. <laughs> exactly, man. But yeah, that's been the Out Cheer Podcast. Guys, thank you so much for listening. If you're on YouTube, make sure you.
Like and subscribe. Still break it, man. Like and subscribe. Did I break it? Nah, I said that's play. not broken. Oh, okay. Cool. Like and subscribe. Yeah. Um. Him. Isn't this supposed to light up or something? The batteries are in. And that like, because of the light in the room, it just looks stupid. Fair enough. Make sure you like and subscribe. And then also, if you're on Spotify or Apple Podcasts, make sure you give us a rating. Make sure you give us a review. That's exactly what we want. Five stars. I don't know. Kendrick's been influencing me. I don't know why he's been doing that. <laughs> I don't know why he's been doing that. Yeah. <laughs> I was like, I killed him and then I killed it. <laughs> but yeah, it's been Miss MB. And we out of here. We out of here. Okay.